Hi, I'm Olivia Wayson, joined here by Sam Cucuzella, and the two of us are basically Hen Sports Night resident Maryland sports fans. So today he and I are going to discuss basically how much we love the Ravens and the Orioles. First thing I want to talk about is they recently announced that the Ravens' first game is going to be a rematch of the AFC Championships against the Chiefs at Airhead Stadium. And Sam, I want to hear your thoughts because I have thoughts. <laughs> Yeah, I mean, obviously I'm a bit worried, you know, that game still does, you know, um, it still does scar a bit deep, but, you know, it makes sense. The Chiefs are currently the league's media darling. They're pulling in all the money with, you know, the whole Patrick Mahomes thing, the whole, you know, Travis Kelsey, Taylor Swift uh, relationship. Um, and, you know, Lamar's the MVP. They have Derrick Henry, and it's going to re be a rematch of the AFC Championship game. So, you know, of course, they're going to have that as a game. It's going to be very entertaining. I think we have a good chance, especially with Derrick Henry versus Chris Jones. But, you know, we'll just see how that goes. 100%. I'm excited that we have Derrick Henry. I mean, yeah. you know, I've heard good things, and I really think he's going to be a great addition to our team, helping us get better. But... I agree with you about being really nervous for this game because, yes, obviously, like you said, last time it was painful. It, it hurt yeah. a lot. I don't um, know if we'd last an hour in the asylum where they were raised. Oh. I, had <laughs> well, to, I had to pull out a reference. <laughs> with that, let's move on to the Baltimore Orioles. Um, we've been doing really well for the past couple of seasons, but this season, I mean, we're currently number one in the, in the yeah. American League. Uh, it's really exciting. I mean, we have some really great players. We have Mullins and Rutschman and Henderson and tons. So tell me your thoughts. Yeah, I mean, Hadley Rutschman, the past few games, he's been going off. This game today was, like, worrying me for a bit just because we've had, like, you know, just we left a lot of runners on base. But then the bottom of the ninth inning, Jordan Westberg comes on, Adley Rutschman comes in, ends the Blue Jays' season. Not yet, but they will soon. Uh, this is four home runs for Adley in the past three games. He's been hitting the cover off the ball, and Adley's uh, sweepless streak continues regular season because the Rangers had other plans in the playoffs. But just overall, I think it's been a very good start to the year. Absolutely. And last thing I want to talk about is just the Orioles stadium and our traditions because it's honestly really special. And I feel like if you're not an Orioles fan, you might not know all these things. I mean, first of all, just Camden Yards is just beautiful. But we also have Mr. Splash. Would yeah. you like to tell us about Mr. Splash? So Mr. Splash is a brand new tradition uh, that started with the O's. In the early part of last season, they started a celebration where every time someone would get on base, they'd like spit water out. And that eventually just became a whole thing where they have Mr. Splash. They've had guest splashers. They had Governor Wes Moore once, former outfielder Adam Jones, and current owner David Rubenstein was a recent one. And also, speaking of Maryland sports, lacrosse is a very big sport here. And with that, let's actually look at Delaware's club lacrosse program, headquartered by our very own Andrea Plumser.